you guys understand the airport's a public place, right? You guys know it's a public place? You know that? Do you guys know that? You know people can see you and what you're wearing in the airport? Do you know that? Because I don't think you do. I see some things. You, know. you see the people with their house pillow? The, the adults, they take their pillow from their bed, their home pillow, out of the house. Because you have a two-hour layover, and God forbid you stand upright for two hours. God, i got to lie down on the floor of a carpeted public establishment. It's 2 o'clock in the afternoon. I'll be exhausted. Go ahead, lie down. Yeah, right there. Right there. Go ahead. No, that's right. right there. Perfectly fine. Right there in front of Panda Express. Go ahead, lie down. <laughs> He's been on our show many times before. Chris Frangelo is a writer, comedian, and also can be heard hosting his highly successful podcast, Cover to Cover, with Chris Frangiola, and a frequent contributor on the... Uh, Wildly successful Juicy Scoop podcast, too. I've heard him on both. He's back in Chicago. You did Rose Monsanis last night. Last night, yes. Chicago tomorrow. Yes. Ah. Very exciting. Happy to be back. Thank you for having me. Yeah, yeah. I love this show. Always fun. The pillow bit. <laughs> I, kill, I just had my, the comedian who was opening for me. Yeah. Showed up to the airport just on my way here <laughs> with his pillow. No. <laughs> No, 38-year-old no, man, big pillow, no pillowcase on it. Oh. Yeah, just brown spots. Oh, oh. come on. He goes, he goes, oh, I'm sorry, it happens when I sleep. I said, what? What, what happens when what? you sleep? What comes out of your head? Root beer? What, what is that? Yeah, so, I mean, just. Is this, yeah. is this I mean, is it a rough life being a comedian it's on a, the road? Is that the guy who opens? As, yeah, as you oh can see, it's a rough God. life. Yeah. Flying used to be luxurious. Oh, those right? days Remember? are over. It's yeah. over. It's now. like getting on a Greyhound yeah. bus. Now. I have TSA pre check, so it's a little bit better. Well, you you're know? fancy. Well, Things are going well. <laughs> Things are going. <laughs> but every airport's different. I have to ask. Do I have to my, you know, my belt? Yeah, like, yeah. Only if it's got metal on it. Oh, you mean like every belt ever made? I'm, I'm not a scarecrow. Well, piece my pants with a piece of rope. It's a belt. <laughs> So, yeah, that's a uh, wild you times. You, guys, I, you have a little girl now, right? I do. It, so you're. Young, young yeah. kid, and you're a first-time parent, right? I know. Yeah, I'm not supposed to say this, but because I, I, I'm supposed to say I don't like going on the road and leaving my family, but I love going on the road <laughs> <laughs> and leaving my family. Well, yeah, yeah, so it's so exciting. Is, yeah. Whoosh. It's a lot. It's How a is lot. it at the mommy and me when all the parents are like 25 and then you come yeah. in and that's tough, right? And it is tough because I get a lot of, how's your granddaughter? And I'm like, all right, <laughs> let's, let's not. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. So I'm that guy now. Oh. Yeah, that's why I had dressed like Danny Zuko yeah. at eight o'clock in the morning, so I look a little bit hipper. Yeah. Because yeah, I could I could kind of feel oh. like oh, he's a hip grandpa. <laughs> I'm like I'm the dad. <laughs> it's great that you're in Chicago. Do you, do you get excited though when you have to go to your your Omaha's and your uh, St. Louis? Yeah, yeah. When I'm in Omaha and St. Louis, I say I'm excited <laughs> you, about you it. Say but, it. Yeah, yeah, but when I'm in Chicago, I say no, I'm not excited at all about it. But yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll get excited for it. Yeah, they're all they're all nice. Everybody's nice. I heard you talking on your podcast about getting fired from one of those corporate gigs that comedians oh, in do. Houston, yeah. That, mm. how did, are those, sometimes those pay really well, but sometimes yeah. those are brutal, right? Brutal, the worst. Yeah, it's just a one thousand guys in like Patagonia vest and Dockers, just <laughs> angry at everything I said. I was opening for a Journey cover band. I'm like, well, isn't Journey a cover band? Like they, so uh, yeah, and then, and then they fired me. I was supposed to do two weeks in a row. They're like, just, you don't need to do the next one. Because they're like, <laughs> so. they're ignoring you when you're at those things, right? Yeah, so you're nobody to... cares. They oh. don't want, everyone's just drinking White Zinfandel and eating, <laughs> you know. And that's it. So, but and then I'm up there just screaming and yelling about pillows or whatever. And, uh, yeah, they weren't having it. Thank God for these podcasts, right? That brings you guys, uh, oh, you can stay home a lot more, can't that's you That's it. Now? I'm in the garage, doing it out of the garage. It's great. Come on. It. Yeah. And yeah. having so. a kid, get, i got to imagine, gives you more material, so there's a, an added benefit to having <laughs> I, a child. It does. I'm getting a lot of material. I'm trying to figure out exactly how to use it where I won't scar her for life, you know? Uh, so I, I'm getting there. I'll find a way to figure it out. I'm watching a lot of, like, Paw Patrol at this point. Oh. That, that's right. I, I'm yeah. not up on any TV outside of, like, 
Bluey. You know, Bluey. Yeah. Oh, that's a new one. Bluey. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. that's a big one. Uh, uh, yeah, at least it's Australian, I yeah. think. So I feel somewhat international <laughs> when I watch it. Well, um, hopefully you can be make her an influencer. Start her young. Get yeah. her involved I on will. your Instagram. Yeah, I hope so. Yeah, I just don't. <laughs> yeah, so it, it's it's wild times out there. You know, oh so. God. Well, you can catch Chris tomorrow night at Zadie's in uh, Chicago for tickets information at Zadie's.com. Good to see you again. Thank you very much, Robin. Yeah. Thanks, Larry. Good Thanks, to see Paul. you guys.